Hey guys, and welcome to my next reaction to Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I am so excited to get into a new era. It, I mean, I'm just really excited for the production of this season. Obviously, I love the plot and I'm really excited to see what happens next, especially because this is the final season, but oh my goodness, like I just love, like I'm getting excited to see what the like titles are going to look like that you know the marvel's agents of shield or or what the the costuming is going to look like and and everything i it's just i get really excited for uh the day every week that i'm recording shield obviously i love the characters i love the story and i'm you know i can't wait to see what happens but obviously this is an added like bonus that I'm just so thrilled to enjoy every week, I guess. Um, but anyway, I hope that you guys are excited for my reaction. Let's get into it. Shut up! What is this? Oh, yeah! Oh my, I'm dying. I'm actually... This is the best thing ever. Tonight's episode, A Trout in the Milk. Let's get it. Oh my god, the music. Oh my god. This is the New York City I remember. I got news for you. This isn't actually our time period. Well, fortunately, there's a fashionable source every decade, so you are set. Dive in and embrace the 1970s. Starting now. Yep. I can't believe You've got it. hideout is still running. And let's not keep Enoch waiting any longer. He's been chilling for like four decades. Oh, God, get Enoch now. God, I hope he's there. Oh, well, okay. This place changed. Enoch, where are you, babe? Because if you and Fitz don't bump lemons, so to speak, you know, my mom is never going to exist, and then I won't be born. It's, I mean, Again. fair point. Bye, Nana. Oh, my God, Nana. What? The recon isn't the only reason why we're here. Oh. Here for you? Yeah, no, for real. <laughs> In my book, that constitutes as a big night. I was wondering why you brought me here. Ooh. I'm hardly even fit for recon. Then why do you call me Yo-Yo? Because you always bounce back. Oh my God. I gotta cry. Oh my god. Hey. Ooh. Something's different. Uh oh. Where is Enoch? And uh, they haven't seen Enoch in at least over a year. <gasps> Where is he? Welcome the man responsible, my boss and our friend. Wilfred Mallet. Fred is still alive. Sounds like Hydra's 40 years ahead of schedule. I present to you Project Insight. Well, we have some problems. Just a... Just a couple. Oh, no. Agent Chastity McBride, WDHR liaison, and I find your professional decorum refreshing. Uh, we're still three years away, but rest assured, 1976 won't just be the bicentennial. It will also be a new birth for freedom. It is interesting. She's, if she can get a kind of a hold of her powers, it's, she will be able to interrogate people pretty They're well. so miserable at these things. So that must make you Gideon Malik. 
Guilty as charged. Let's talk about us. Maybe you start by telling me your name. Uh, I actually have to get going, so let's... How about you stick around? Sweetheart, who's your new friend? This is Gideon Malik. Gideon, this is... Our fiance. Honey, I think we need to go. Uh, excuse us. We're looking. I'm sure we'll turn oh, up. No. You know, so oh, no. Oh. You know, if you have his last whereabouts, I can take point on the search. Project Insight is our priority. Ah! Copy that. I'll see what I can pull from Radio Chatter. I slightly don't agree. Good luck. Okay. Slightly. You made the right call to preserve the timeline. No, to hell with the status quo. Thousands oh. of lives are at risk. There's hey. still time. The guy's had three extra years. Who knows what else he's gotten into? Also, oh, I'm scared different. that Gemma is... I don't know what's going this on with her, but she busy. seems to be in pain. What? See, called it. Whoa, high tech. <laughs> <laughs> that made me laugh. Wait, Bruce Banner. Never heard of him. That's because he's just a kid now, but in a few decades he becomes an Avenger. I certainly think you guys made the timeline worse than it was before. <sighs> well, you have no time to speculate. Speculate? This is more than just a drop in the milk. Hey. I just wanted to thank you for coming in tonight. Pleasure. My friends told me differently. Uh huh. So, what's our play? Counter offer. Let us go when the kid walks. Anything else you're telling me? Oh! I'll explain later, let's go. <laughs> oh my god. He's probably having a hell of a day. Oh, uh oh. We gotta find some wheels and get out of here. You never know, like, what little moment is gonna have an effect. Fuck. Come with me if you want to continue to exist. <laughs> And its fuel economy is best in class. Woo! Guys, is it supposed to do that? Simmons, what's happening? The jumping alley. To when? Where are we going? I don't know. I can't control it. There's the only chance to stop inside the kid on the ship. There's nothing else you could have done. How far did we jump? Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, yo. We have official green light. Project Insight is ready for launch. Oh, oh no! You are forgetting. I'm getting confused. I, I'm not sure. Have you told anyone else? I'm afraid to. So you're screwing with time, but you have no idea what you're doing. Hey, back off. She's oh. trying. That's not good enough. You're playing with matches and burning the house down. Leave her alone. <gasps> not until I get some answers. I was taken out of my life for this. Yeah, we all work. We all work. Listen up. Deke. Oh my gosh, Deke. Oh my god. Oh my god, I love him. I'm, I'm not mad at Susan either, but like... How? The base is fortified by now. If this ever can't open fire, we'd give up our position. Run now, bring him in. And do what with him? I don't know yet. We can't keep him locked up forever, Mac. We'll figure it out. Just bring him in, the clock's ticking. This is getting messy. It's getting messy, people. It's getting messy. Why not just put these two on the list? That would not be as effective. You will deliver this message. Loud and clear. Uh oh. I don't know. Maybe you need a bigger computer. That thing's too small. 
That's how it works. What? But only old people use it for calls. Wow. Yeah, you look you look okay for a guy who just aged 20 years. <laughs> oh I Let's love this. The line. I get it. Just it's hard. wish I could have said some goodbyes. Oh. 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 I'm gonna cry. Just wondering if it'll ever feel that way again. I'm wondering if I'm ever going to feel anything again. Oh my god, May. I'm so happy you came back in my life. Ah! God. This Malik family's pissing me off. <laughs> Daisy, do you copy? Someone's a no. response. No! Her signal has dropped. Keep trying to reach her. We're running out of time. Shield has been infiltrated by a Hydra cell aided by sentient time traveling aliens. STTAs. And then we could. Just to be what it is. Hey! I was getting through to him. He felt otherwise. Sorry, sir. <laughs> we have something you'll desperately want. Oh, no. Will you quit talking. Let's go. They let you think that you had a fighting chance. Oh no. I'm scared. And there's nothing you can do. Because the Chronicoms see everything. They see what you're going to do and they know exactly. They see that coming? What did you just do? He's supposed to be dead, right? Status quo. Whoa! Deek! Deke! Whoa! No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is messy. It's messy. I'm position. Mac. Are those prisoners? My parents. <gasps> And may flip the base. No drone. And you won't you won't exist. No 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 wait. Try it. It's a mess. It's a mess. This is a mess. This is a fucking mess. I'm so stressed out right now. Oh, fuck. Direct hit. Missiles detonated on impact. But we just gave up our position. Yep. Yep. There are some issues. There's there's a lot of problems well, happening right now. I'm not really okay with it. Daniel Whitehall. Daniel. So Block D. No. I don't want to see the old man. I just want his instructions. Yes, genius. I want them written down. Not Whitehall. I want to find out if it works. Fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Like, oh! Fuck you. I really have to say that going like through the past and going through like all of this stuff, it, it, it's just to me like we're, we're able to kind of bring up so much of S.H.I.E.L.D.'s history and not just S.H.I.E.L.D.'s history, but just the show's history as well with, you, you know, stuff like Gideon Malik and then Whitehall and I, I don't know, I'm just really... Um, quite uh liking all of the callbacks um it's really uh it's quite a season i think i think for the fans of the show and the people who have kind of been loyal to the show for for so long and and everything i really like that just wanted to say that i also want to briefly say that my head right now is splitting i am in a lot of pain i you know um and so these uh, thoughts might be a little shorter than normal because I am just not feeling terribly well at this given moment. 
Um, wow. I mean, obviously, if they have three years to prepare, three years to like kind of know when Shield's gonna turn up. Was it three years? I think. Um, but if they have years to prepare, you know, they're obviously going to be able to, you know, I, I mean, the thing with Max's parents was just, that was really like, just, I didn't know if that was, I don't know how old Mac is. So I didn't know if that would also make him disappear. Um, but you know, I, I just, 76? Hey. Um, <laughs> um, but, you know, obviously that's like, it's very emotional and, and, and just something that, oh my God, I just can't even believe that. I really, that was crazy. A lot of, I feel like, shocking moments in this, you know, obviously Deke taking the shot. You know, Deke's been kind of going a bit back and forth. I, I, I do hope that he's okay with his decision. I mean, obviously, uh, this guy has kind of lived past when he was supposed to. Um, but I, I do hope that it doesn't really upset Deke and he is at peace with the decision that he made. You know what I mean? Because I feel like he's been kind of struggling going back and forth of what's right and what's wrong in this and so I'm a little concerned that he's gonna have a lot of guilt at some point so um, but I was pretty shocked by that um, and then uh, oh my god just crazy everything is just so crazy right now um, I don't know I just feel like there's there's quite a few like big moments and um and some really kind of i guess sweet character moments as well i'm absolutely adoring the scenes with daisy and daniel um and i you know i think they're getting kidnapped together so i think he's about to get uh, uh and and i don't know what's going on with whitehall in that whole situation but that is a situ fucking -wation. um so i'm very interested to see uh, how, um, Daniel, he's going to get like a, some education into, in humans and all of that. And, and, and that's going to be interesting, but also, um, I think, uh, in general, I really have loved the focus on how he's coping with everything. You know, he's obviously having a little bit of a hard time dealing with all of this stuff that's, that has happened to him. Um, I think Deke had a really, really good point saying, you know, like we all have, we all like got plucked out of our lives and, and everything. So, um, the only thing I will say is that they do have each other and they have been a team for so long and, and, and Daniel has just met everybody. So I will say that that's maybe like the one thing that kind of separates him a little bit in that sense. Um, but, uh, Deke sticking up for, for Nana, Oh my God, warm my heart, warm my heart, warm my heart. Oh my God, I just, I adore him. And I I do like their relationship. I am very concerned about what is going on with her. I'm very, very nervous. I don't really know, you know, um, and she seems to be losing it a little bit and that's not good. Uh, I would assume, you know. Um, it's good that Enoch is there um, and hopefully it'll be okay. Um, what else? Um, I do love that they're kind of showing the, um, great things about May, um, being able to sense people's feelings and stuff. It really does help with interrogation and situations like that. You know, she can probably be a, a decent, um, you know, if she's talking to somebody, she can tell if they're worried. She can tell, like, even in that first conversation um, with the guy, like, she can, when she has a handshake, like, she can kind of be like, 
okay, it, does he seem like his like he's attracted to me? Is he like, or is it, it is that not the way to go? Do I have to be like all business to get information? And I feel like it's just all going to be very, very helpful once she can kind of master it and rein it in, so to speak. Um, I guess the last thought that I'm gonna have, because I mean, genuinely, I'm I'm really hurting right now. My head is pounding. Um, is that I love that they found Enoch and that he came to kind of save the day. I am just really happy and I hope he stays and we don't have to, you know, like, because Enoch is, I, I was very concerned about him being all on his own and it just made me feel really emotional. So I'm very happy that he is back with the team. Um, it's a whole ass mess right now. I mean, every, people are separated. People are in b bad situations. I am just not, mm -mm. it's getting messy. I think I said a, quite a few reactions ago, or maybe the first reaction of this season, like it's going to get messy and it's gonna, there's gonna be some gray areas and things are gonna suck. Um, and we're getting to that. We're really getting to that. We're diving right in. So um, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.